Yo, 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 what is up, Halo community? Hope you're all having a fantastic day. Today, I would like to update you guys on the Halo World Championship Twitch drops. There are actually some pretty good drops, so you definitely don't want to miss out on these. Now, before we continue, if you guys can hit that sub and like button, I would highly appreciate it. Now, enough of wasting your time, let's get right into the drops. So, all these drops will be available October 20th all the way up to October 23rd. The stream starts at 12 p.m. Pacific time and 3 p.m. Eastern time. And of course, this will all be streamed via twitch.tv slash halo. I'll have a link to it down below. So let's take a look at the first drop. So the first drop is called Winner's Circle, which is a nameplate and emblem. This one is available October 20th all the way up to 23rd. So the entire event for this drop, you have to watch for two hours. On to the next drop, which is also a nameplate and emblem. It's called On Track. This one is available October 21st all the way to October 23rd. Same amount of watch time, two hours and you should get that emblem. Now here's where it starts picking up. So on October 22nd, all the way up to October 23rd, you can get the On Track Mark 7 armor coating. For this coating, you have to watch for two hours as well. On to the next drop, we got the Gladiator's Edge armor coatings, and this one is available across three different cores. That is the Mark 7 core, the Eagle Strike core, and the Rakashasha core. These are only available on the final day, October 23rd. And once again, you have to watch for two hours. On to the final drop, we got the Gladiator's Edge BR and the Halo World Championship Weapon Charm. So these are available on the Grand Finals, only the Grand Finals of, of October 23rd. So that's literally down to the final match and you have to watch for one hour. So this one's gonna be a little more tricky to get. Uh, you definitely wanna keep an eye out for this one specifically, because this one's literally only available during the grand finals. So that concludes this video. Those are all the Twitch drops that you can get at the Halo World Championship. There may be some co-streamer drops. Usually there typically is. If I had to guess, I think the co-streamer drop is going to be the armor effect. Uh, I forgot what it was called, but it's like these laurel things or whatever the heck they're called. Really cool armor effect but that's just me speculating that's just my guess i feel like that's probably gonna be it anyways i'll update you guys on that drop as well once again consider subscribing and liking the video i really do appreciate it helps me out and of course if you want to stay updated on more halo content just like this thanks for watching peace